Rob and I found this one. You're an open person. I keep my open minded. Let's get straight into it and we'll get your thoughts. You how to use fur first pronouns and sentences. Today I'm gonna be teaching you how to use prince, princess pronouns and today I'm gonna be teaching you how to use shark sharks pronouns and sentences. Today I'm gonna be teaching you how to use flower flowers pronouns and sentences. Today I'm gonna be teaching you how to use wolf wolf's pronouns and sentences. Today I'm gonna be teaching you how to use paint paints pronouns and sentences. Today I'm gonna be teaching you how to use Absolutely not. We're not normalizing this. This is getting out of hand. I'm sure this person is a really nice person, so don't go sending them hate. But what they're saying, along with what a few other people are saying, along with this agenda that I keep, not even, I'm not even seeing it on TikTok. I'm seeing it all over social media, even on the news. I'm getting sick of it because at this point, we're just changing the English language to a point where we're taking nouns, objects, things, and we're making them pronouns. And we simply have to say yes to it because that's how people express themselves. This is not expressing. We are at this point mocking trans individuals, not even trans individu individuals, non-binary individuals, because you have people who, you know, really struggle with their identity, who have, who have taken the time to seriously reevaluate their lives and say, you know what? I'm no longer a girl. I'm a boy. I go by he, him pronouns now. Then you look across the street. Oh, hi. I go by paints, paints, paints. I go by <laughs> Yeah, the paint one, that one threw me off. If you're a minor and you want to call me a transphobe and ableist, I'm going to wake up every day, every day, and I'm going to still live my life normally. Because at this point, we desensitize the word transphobe, the word ableist so much that it doesn't mean anything. And people in the comments are like, yeah, yeah, I identify as this. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. This is how I express. And I look at those people's profiles and they're 13 years old. Uh, and I'm supposed to- It's not real. This is fantasy that we're trying to live in. He spazzed on that. He really just broke it down. Paints, paints. I don't get the wolf, wolf. Wolf, flower, what the fuck else was on there? Paint, paints. Paint, paints. When do you come to realization like, you know what, I identify as paint, paints. But what does that even mean though? Well, cause the word Paint isn't a pronoun. The word paint is a noun. I agree with the, him saying the, like why should I have to listen to a 13 year old who's trying to identify as this? I feel like all the kids are soaking this up, eating this up way more. Well, don't 13 year olds believe in the tooth fairy and Santa Claus? Mm -hmm. And then what you tell your teachers and your friends and everybody at school, you can't call me that. I identify as this. And when did the wolf's wolves and the paint paint, when did that come into fruition? When did that start? Some random person just said, I'm gonna be a paint can today. Well, again, fur furs, that's not even a word. It ain't even about words. Fuck the paint and the flowers. I can be screw screw. You can literally say beep boop. No, That's bro. beeps. I'm bing bing now. I could demand that people call me daddy. Mm -hmm. And if you don't agree with me and don't call me daddy, you're a bigot. There's one more. And look, I know those ones were crazy. I think you guys should be able to at least sympathize with this one. Yeah. All right, cool. Demon self. And if you're wondering what a self-identifying demon looks like, well, you're in luck. Hi, my name's Jasper. I use they at pronouns. Hi, my name is Liana. I use they demon pronouns. <laughs> they demon. <laughs> so we're going to basically present three sentences. Um, one of them is going to have one pronoun. The other one's going to have the other pronoun. And then the last one is going to have both pronouns. Yeah, aren't they mocking at this point? So the first sentence would be, Liana is my partner. They are cute and I am theirs. I love them very much and I hope they love themselves too. For the demon pronouns, it would be, Liana is my partner. Deem is cute and I belong to Deem. I love Demon very much, and I hope Dean loves Demon? Him. She hyphened it to Dean. Yeah, Dean. She shortened it to Dean. Deem. 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 Demons. Liana is my partner. They are cute, and I am Dean's. I love Demon very much, and I hope they love Demon self, too. It's hard to talk to someone to like that because you have to change your whole vernacular and you're expected to change the way that you communicate with someone and talk in a way, right? You're not allowed to mess up because that's disrespectful. And those kids still live with their parents, so it's like they're in there probably convincing their parents to abide by that. Well, the parents nowadays, they can't even talk back or anything because they just have to accept it. And they're going to start teaching this stuff in schools now. Watch. Bro, they already are. I had a, one of my tattoo artists said that his daughter, who's maybe in third grade, third, fourth grade, the girl was saying she made a friend with someone who went by something like this. Oh, God. And then the dad said, 
we ain't doing that. If you start saying that in school, the teacher's gonna be like, what are you talking about? You can be the girl's friend. We're not applying that. Yeah, how can you be a teacher when every student has a different pronoun? How can you conduct a class? It's like girls on this side, boys on this side, demons, demons in the back. We'll get the wolves in the corner. And then paints and All paint. the painters to the left. <laughs> and there is something very on the nose about this. In fact, in the gospels, when Jesus encountered demon-possessed people, they would sometimes go by they, them pronouns because there was more than one demon infesting the person. And so we may be able to draw some connections and analogies here. But I'm afraid that a lot of people on the sane side of the ideological spectrum might see this sort of thing and make the same mistake they made with gender ideology more broadly, assuming that it's kind of a weird and wacky phase and it's not anything widespread or serious or worth our attention. Why, why are we even paying attention? This is just TikTok. Who cares? And in saner times, you know, in a culture that hadn't already sunk below the surface and into the icy depths of full-on insanity, <laughs> that would probably be the right reaction. After all, demon self over there is really just a goth kid trying to be edgy, right? We had those when I was a teenager. The only difference is that now TikTok exists, so they have this unfortunate vehicle to publicize and advertise mm -hmm. these embarrassing phases. That's not the only difference. The other difference, and it's a big one, is that we now live in a society that validates, legitimizes, and encourages these alternative identities. Because you could be like, oh, just let me have fun on TikTok, but that gets pushed out to the world, and the world agrees with that. We're witnessing the beginning of the end. It's almost like toothpaste. Once you squeeze it out of the bottle, it don't go back in. It's too far now. And I feel bad because I don't go on TikTok, so now I feel like when I walk outside, I'm behind on the world because now I'm going to go talk to the Starbucks barista and be like, hey, do you think she could bring me my cup? I'm it's sorry. paints. Uh, okay. So I'm scared to meet new people. I don't want to assume like De demon. I said this before, probably in older videos. America is so highly technologically advanced. We have these apps. We have good medical technology. Like there are no immediate threats to people on a daily basis. Like gone are the days of saber tooth tigers having to get you. Gone are the days of like true starvation where everyone's starving. Yeah, there's homeless people and there's bad situations that happen to people. But on the grand scheme of things in this country, it's a very privileged and well-off nation, then people have to manufacture problems because I think it's the human condition to want to feel like something's against you and you have to overcome it. And this is my, this is my struggle uh, because to say, yeah, I live a perfect life with no struggles and no problems. No, people can't say that. They don't want to say that. They don't sound good. They had to be, okay, is, there, is my shelter good? Whatever. Are we hungry? Do we eat enough food? Okay. And, and now you can literally be stuck at home all day and create problems when you're literally mm -hmm. in a home with food, AC, See everything you need to survive. Yes. Now you're off fighting people because they won't call you a paint can. Yeah. And when you want some attention, it's easier to be like, okay, well, I identify as this now, guys. Yeah. Yes. People are looking for community. And the more support you're going to get as well because you got more people in that same mindset. So you have a bunch of societal outcasts, loners, whatever. Everyone's on their phones. No one speaks. No one's friends anymore. I feel depressed. And then you see paint paints. And then, oh, yeah, that's me. That's me. And then you find out other people of that same coalition. Yeah, me too. And I'm Wolf. And I'm Pink. Yeah. I also think those people are friends within themselves. Yes. Like the wolves are friends with the paints and the paints are friends with the furs. Yes. And then the, the demon self thing. Why isn't that banned? Does that not seem no, harmful? Di Disney has a new demon cartoon. I think I was telling Stop. you about the demon. No. The parents are like demons and sort of something like that. And it's normal, Ryan. What is this mouse is what? Gray? And imagine everyone sees that this is gray and I go, it's gray. And then y'all both say, no, it's red. I go, no, it's And then we get two more people to say it's red. And then everyone else starts saying it's red, red, red. And now I've got a thousand people saying, that's red. And I'm sitting here. And you just have to just be quiet and call it red. There's no barrier to this. There's no, okay, that's it. Yeah, I'm not saying things to be black and white, but there's no parameters, boundaries. And it started, not saying it started, but like, I was already tired enough of the astrology stuff. Start? This wasn't a thing when we were in school. Back in my day, it was just goth kids. They yeah. were just goth yeah, kids. Yeah, like scene kids, yeah. Now this is, this is it. The, well, you don't fit in with any group, just make your own. Group. Yeah, make your own two, three, four, five. You're a one, two, I'm two, three, you're a three, four. And if anyone else doesn't refer to us as that, I will physically assault them. I don't even know my message. Save yourself at this point. Normalize everything. Nah, bro. Maybe not the demon one. Can we not normalize that? I don't want to normalize it. That term normalize, they say normalize this, normalize that. Well, that ain't normal. So I ain't gonna normalize that. So I that. won't. Normalize this. No, that's not normal. <laughs> Yeah, it's not normal. <laughs> Can we normalize normal again? Yeah, the, no, the word normal don't even mean normal no more. No, it does not. The English language, you're not even allowed to abide by those rules anymore. The grammatical things, beep bop boop bop. 
Yeah, they're gonna have to change the whole English classes to everything's just shifting. I mean, demon could end up being a teacher. They they already have the demons and stuff as teachers, and you have to hire them, right? Well, you're not gonna hire me because I'm a demon. Yeah. Scary times. They're here. We will be the channel to talk about it too. When is this ever gonna end? It just gets more ridiculous every day. Seriously, and I've never been a re uber religious person, like super into it. But demon self? Yeah. How can you tell demon self that you need Jesus? They are just bored people with no problems and no and no perspective of the world. They got no problems. They, you have no problems, so you gotta make one. I'm a very open-minded person, but please, oh my God, please. <laughs> That's why I said at the beginning I was open-minded and now I'm like, bro, I don't know. It only works like in the TikTok realm, like in the real world, like you really can't go around saying that kind of stuff. You can, and I've seen it starting to trickle in and I'm like, we're doomed. It's just a game I won't play because people did start playing along, now they wanna force us to. All it took was one. There's has to be more people that say this is crazy than, but the majority of people are too scared to say, yo, can we stop this for a second? Cause what the hell is this? So if I start getting my part. problems wrong in my test, can I yell and be like, no, but I think that answer is right. I identify as an A plus. <laughs> Who told me, was it you that said they can't address them as boys and girls anymore? Oh, at Disneyland. Stop. Dreamers. <laughs> You can't say hi, princess. Is there any hope for anyone at this point? That's it. Yeah, companies are changing. Everything we Companies are like, I just want to I'll make money. Whatever y'all- Now, if I get fired because everybody at work doesn't want to call me a demon, I make one TikTok, I shut down the whole establishment. Mm -hmm. Aren't these the people that are begging for acceptance and like, they're the most tolerant. They just want that everyone to accept them. When someone doesn't accept or tolerate them, they absolutely destroy them. Is that not a contradiction? Maybe we need to interview a demon. Shit, not in here. I need the good vibes in. <laughs> We can uh, we can interview a paint. Okay, okay, paint seems more or a yeah, flower. suitable for the channel. I think. Save yourselves. Save yourselves, please.